Okay, here we're going to do the word ample in D script. So, simplest possible combination, A, M, P, L, E. Okay, uh, first thing we can do is we can save a stroke over here and just loop through. I always call this a simplest combination because it kind of illustrates the basic principles. And this is technically a, a fusion of letters. So, A, M, and then the P. I like to draw it like this usually because sometimes I don't actually want to extend out the bottom. Uh, the key with the P is that it has to come in from the top here, unlike the U, which would connect like so. That's how you tell them apart. Now we can merge the L into the P like so, and then we can even add the E at the end. That is looking very promising. I can see that is being squeezed up quite tightly easily. Let's just have a look and see what we would get if we went over here. And then we could put the E off to either side, maybe. This side might pose some interesting squeezing up. I think our best option was putting the L into the E. So, A have curved earlier. P L E A M P L E no A M P L E. I don't particularly like coming out of the P this way usually, but I, there's no reason that wouldn't be like uh, ambiguous with anything else. There's no contradiction, so we'll try it that way. There, it fits quite nicely. Ample. And I don't know if there's maybe a way to visualize that as symbol symbolizing its meaning. 